Okay, I'm going to take you on a very quick tour of the 2016 Cams Jayco Australian Formula 4 car. The car itself in 2016 is a Miguel chassis, exactly the same as last year. Uh, it's got a lot of mechanical grip produced by the hand-cooked tyre, again, same as last year. I'm going to start with the uh, aerodynamics of the car. As you can see, it looks very similar to a Formula 1 car. It's got the front wing the rear wing at the back there. There's minimal adjustment on the front and rear wings to try and keep it simple for these young drivers as, they, as they're learning about the engineering of the car. They do produce a lot of downforce. At a circuit like Phillip Island, for example, the cornering speeds are in actual fact faster than a V8 supercar. The braking ability of the car, to uh, put it in perspective, one of these cars at a circuit like uh, Simmons Plains here, they'll be braking roughly the 50 metre mark from about 220 kilometres an hour. So incredible braking ability uh, that comes both from the hand-cooked tyre as well as the downforce that it produces. Powering this Formula 4 car is a Ford EcoBoost 1.6 litre turbocharged engine, roughly 160 horsepower, and this is the same regulations globally, so every single Formula 4 car in the world has to meet this limitation on horsepower. It can't be too powerful because we do have 15 and 16 year old drivers in these cars. Moving on to the cockpit now. Firstly, the safety of these cars is arguably the best in the world. They meet the new FIA regulations. It's a carbon monocoque chassis. There's an extractable seat in the event of uh, an emergency situation. The steering wheel itself, it's paddle shift, very similar to Formula One. The right paddle to go up the gears, the left paddle to go down the gears. There's a couple of other buttons on the steering wheel to assist the drivers with, with the data. There's a bit of information that comes up on the, uh, on the display there. It makes it very easy for these drivers to extract the absolute most uh, out of these vehicles. I've been lucky enough to drive one of these Formula 4 cars and they're an incredible vehicle to drive. They're a great car to hone the skills as these young guys get up and going and uh, gain momentum in their careers.